Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Pardon my entrance. I could have been a little bit more entertaining with my entrance, but sadly, my stage has grown dim. Back in my day, I was quite the entertainer, you know. But sadly, my life for entertainment is no more, hence why I have changed my career path to lead me to you here, hero. Oh! Allow me to introduce myself. How rude of me for not even introducing myself. What an entertainer I am. I am Mr. Compress. It's an honor to meet you, hero. Although my entrance could have been a little bit more flashy, I still have a little bit more ill will intent with you heroes. You see... My boss and my organization, the LOV, are looking for something. Something that'll make our stage quite the grand performance. I'm talking about the boy with the green hair. What was his name? Izuku? Yes, him. He's on his own now, isn't that correct? Hmm. As I expected. Well, it's quite easy. We want him on our side. You see, an entertainer like him, well, I can assure you it will be quite the performance if he was on our side. <coughs> Pardon. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm still a little beaten up after our last encounters with heroes. I still have a little bit of a, uh... How do you say it? A lack in performance. But I'm slowly gathering my composure, and I'm slowly getting back to my normal set of mind. But for you, heroes, you are only a mere... Prop in our way. Isn't it obvious? We want him for our own. We want him because, well, we need him. You see, with his power and his outstanding performance as a hero, but sadly his stage has also grown dim, and that's why he ran away from you. All you heroes have abandoned him in his time of need. Therefore, we want him on our side so we can release all of our other actors and performers to be on our side while we take on the League of Heroes. And then we can take this world upon our own acting stage. This performance would be hard to pull off, but I'm pretty sure if we have this Izuku on our side... Then our performance will be grand and be live, televised, across the nation. Oh, I don't think you understand here. You see, as you were distracted by my other fellows, I have hidden away some of your other friends here. As a slight trick of hand... You could see them here in my marbles. But you're not allowed to have them as long as we can make a deal here. Yes, quite. Alongside your teammates here, I want to exchange them for the boy. I knew you would drive a hard bargain, 
quite a hard performance to pull off. But I myself am a professional and magician. Well, we have a few tricks up our sleeve. You see here, I have a detonator. This detonator has been set up across all sorts of buildings. There's some set up in Tokyo, and there's some set up in other places that I wish not to announce yet. But, if you're willing to do this trade, I will not set off the detonator. Hmm. I can see your face. You're acting quite angered, sad, and maybe even a little bit scared. <laughs> I knew you heroes were merely just performers. After all, you only do this for your paycheck. Fake heroes. All of you. Nothing but sidekicks waiting for their next paycheck to be put onto their own credit cards. My master was correct. My boss was correct. You heroes are nothing but scum beneath our boots. Well, within everything that I've been taught, I learned that a magician must always keep his tricks under sleeve. And well, as I have been taught, I always keep my secrets between my team and I. No one other. <laughs> Quite the performance you're trying to pull off here, hero. But that's a little bit off the performance that I've been looking for. You see, I'm trying to look for a grand performance, and you're only giving me a mere child's play. Your performance is lackluster as I'm trying to put out. You need training, and a lot more of it. To fight against the LOV, of course. And with our enhanced Nomu running around, causing all torts of mayhem, acting out on their own whims, there's a lot more heroes out there who are trying to stop them, but are getting extremely injured. You could say they're breaking a leg for this performance. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. I laugh into your face because this performance is merely just a child's play put on by kindergartners. You're acting outrageously, not thinking with a clear mind. Your tales are clearly not in the right plot. You're not working as a team. You're only working to help yourselves. And that's why I'm going to be taking your friends here with me as hostage. And I hope you can come up with the right place stories here to bring me what I want, to bring what we want for our grand performance. But, if you don't succeed within my play, I'll have no choice but to keep you in my own play. You have 48 hours to comply to my play, otherwise I will cut you completely from the script of life. The choice is yours, hero. Live to perform another day, or die as a D-list celebrity. <laughs> the choice is yours, but I bid thee farewell, as I have better and bigger performances that I have to go attend to. Ta-ta! And be wary, if you don't comply, your friends will also suffer as the same consequences. I hope you picked the right part for your play. 
<laughs> Ta-ta!